Guys, how are we doing? Welcome to GoodWorks Tractors. Today we're going to be doing a field test with this pull behind sweep all aerator. It's a core plug aerator, commercial grade unit, but priced more like a residential or consumer grade unit. A lot of great features. We did a whole product overview. I'm not going to go into the details right now, but check out that product overview video. You'll get all the features, the benefits, the different qualities that go into the sweep all. This is a product you get 5% off the code GWT on not just the aerator, but on their sweep all sweeper as well. This is earlier than I've ever aerated before. You know you can typically do this in the spring or the fall. We've had a very early spring. It's technically still winter here in Michigan, but we've had a, a long string of 50 and 60 degree days. The grass is starting to green up, so it's starting to grow. This is in that very early season, but you want to aerate if you can while the grass is mowed short, so I want to tackle it now. What are you doing? Huh? Hey, so if you like what you've seen in this video, I'd love to get a thumbs up from you and hit that subscribe button right down below. And if you want more information on this aerator or other cool tractor products, read the description underneath the video or head on over to GoodWorksTractors.com. You've been running hard, huh? Oh. I do want to mention though really quick, this is a tow behind unit, it's not a three point mounted unit. So you see it on a subcompact tractor, but for all you folks that have garden tractors, this is going to work for you as well. You have plenty of power, there's not a lot of rolling resistance here. You can weight it down with all sorts of weight as well to get good pressure and depth on your cores that you want to take out. But get this electric option here, you don't have to worry about getting off to raise and lower the aerator as well, but a lot of good features. Watch that product overview video if you haven't done so yet.
Okay, we're just about done, but a couple things I wanted to share with you. Number one, it crossed my mind as I was uh, aerating here that the, the thatcher might actually be a really good tool if you don't want to worry about sweeping everything or collecting all of them up, if you just want to get them to kind of dissipate and break down all those core plugs. Throw on the thatcher, okay? This thing is great as a rake to collect leaves in the fall or in the spring thatch of course and then maybe also break up those core plugs so just put it on the back of your three point another use for it just break them up and it helps kind of get your lawn back to normal a little bit quicker now this right here don't do what i did all right so use a little bit more common sense but i went over this same spot just too many times how many plugs can you take out of an area before the ground just kind of just starts to disintegrate and and just become a complete mess so this spot right here it was kind of my turning point just one too many times and it, it got a little bit out of hand so be careful just something to keep in mind that when you're you're doing it and you're making your circles going around try to pick different spots and so i started doing an area here and then kind of took a break and did it over there and then made loops in a different area just to mix it up and keep from going over a certain spot too many times well already folks that pretty much wraps it up you know again a good look here field test this is what it's made for doing yards could be a commercial grade unit but again it's really priced right in that wheelhouse there with a lot of the other competition for the, you know, the lower end residential or consumer products as well. I wasn't 100% sure if I was gonna be sold on the receiver mount, but I actually really like it a lot. Love the electric actuator to raise and lower it. I think that's a fantastic feature. If I were gonna get that, I definitely would. You don't really have to get the weight box. Um, if you do have a 55 gallon drum of water, you, there's built in rails uh, that are kind of hidden right down here but there's built-in rails where a barrel will lay right in here so that you can just put that drum in there, but the weight box is an add-on you can get. I'm gonna come back through with the Sweep All Sweeper. Watch that video if you wanna see it in action. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like what you see here, I'd love to get a thumbs up from you and make sure you hit that subscribe button right down below. And as always, read through the description as well. There's gonna be more information on the aerator here, that the Thatcher 2, or head on over to goodworkstractors.com. Thanks so much for stopping by and until next time, stay safe. We'll see you soon.